Hey, what's up everybody? How you doing? Welcome back to Carpo Gaming and another Dragon Dogma 2 video. Another one. That's right, we're back at it again. And today, we're going to be taking you to this cave that have two amazing items, the Redolent Whisper and the Waterfowl Cloak as well. Let go! Once again, thanks for watching everybody. Without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, let's get started. Now, the cave that we headed to is actually a tomb from Checkpoint Rest Town, you want to follow this location right down this road, and then we're going to be hanging up left by the rocky lair. And then we're going to be cutting across the water to the tomb of Tegla. Now, over here, it's pretty straightforward. We're going to be hanging a left, hanging a right, and then there's going to be two chests over here. But there's going to be a ton of undead enemies. In order to get to this cave, you want to swing around and follow the map until you get to the crossroads and you're gonna have to jump across these rocks and then make your way up here and then the cave is kind of hidden all the way back behind these trees you can't really see it from the area that you are coming from but once you make your way over here then it pops up on your map all right now we are here at the tomb of Tegala. Now inside here is going to be a ton of undead enemies. So make sure you are looking out for those guys and be prepared for because it's not just one. It's not just two. There is a ton of these enemies around this area. So be prepared for that. Break down these walls and uh, yeah, get your undead farm on because there's going to be a ton of these enemies all around. You can't just run through here because they will try to swarm you and on top of that try to like block you in these small corridors all right now after you finish taking out all these enemies, you want to come to this gate and once again a ton of more undead enemies like legit there's a ton of them so just be prepared all of these tombs have undead enemies in them and they're going to pop up out of the tombs so yeah here we go now after we finish breaking down this wall to the right this is where we're going to be picking up our first piece of gear and it's pretty cool it's the waterfowl cloak the waterfowl cloak looks pretty sweet and then we're going to take another left bust a u-turn break down this wall and right over here in this chest will be the relevant whisper like i said two amazing items all in one location now the redolent whisper is going to be for the trickster class decent strength the magic is really high strike Strength is cool and knockdown power is kind of low. And the waterfowl cloak, well, hey, not bad at all, especially for a cloak. And it looks really good in 2% elemental resistance and debilitation resistances as well. Here's what the redolent whisper looks like. You can create really cool clones of yourself with this weapon. And on top of that, the waterfowl cloak looks pretty cool as well. So boom, there you have it, my dude. Two really cool items that you can get right here in Dragon Dogma 2. But for right now, that's pretty much going for the video. I hope you truly enjoyed it. As always, if you are new to the channel, how you doing? And welcome. Don't forget to subscribe right here at Carpal Game for a wide variety of videos range from updates, tips and tricks, guys and news, and a whole lot more. So hopefully you enjoyed this video. Once again, thank you everybody for all your love and support. And as always, I'll be seeing y'all in the next one. Later.